Welcome, welcome back, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Moses Bochamp coming at you with another video here on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe, be sure to hit that like button, be sure to leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this whole mystery behind this disappearance of this little girl, little Dulce Maria Alvarez who's been missing since, since September out of Bristol, New Jersey. How do you go missing out of a park? Go figure. Why isn't the uh, authorities like really looking for this little girl? Why is it that we haven't really have had any more press conferences about this little girl? Why isn't the prosecution's office, the mayor and all of these people uh, like really involved in this case Why is it that every time I turn around is a citizen search or a citizen something being done? And it's not the FBI the Bristol police the state police or uh, These uh, agencies that are supposed to be here for our protection our tax dollars pay their salary Why isn't it that they doing why isn't they doing their job? You feel me? That's my question. That's my question. The other day I um, said that I was gonna go live. I, I wasn't able to do it due to um, unforeseen occurrences, uh, internet problem, you know what I'm saying? Uh, not being in my home office. You know what I'm saying? I'm borrowing space right now. And it's uh, very difficult to, um, you know, do these things the way I want to do them. Um, and uh, I, I, I reneged. Not only that, I didn't have the actual proof that I wanted, the, ac the actual information that I wanted to um, present to my audience. I don't like to come to my people with, uh, with bullshit, you feel me? Excuse my language. Um gotta watch my language you know due to the algorithm and all that good stuff so um yeah i'll take that back but yeah the bull crap the bull crap that's going on behind this case had this been a little white girl we would have the united states marine corps we would have the army navy we would have we would have them all air force <laughs> we would have them all looking for this little girl if it was a little white girl but being that She's a little Mexican girl. You don't see this happening. You feel me? So, um, I don't know what's up. I know that I, um, I stated that I was, that I was going to go live, um, uh, about the situation about this co-worker who stated that, uh, the grandma has said that little Dulce Maria Alvarez was deceased. Um, I never got the right information to come at y'all with that so I haven't you know what I'm saying I'm still waiting on that information which I'm really beginning to think that is bull crap uh, because again there's no not, nothing to back it up um, so you know what I'm saying I, I, I don't know why people are putting out this false information out there if it is false you feel me I don't know because it was, you know, I wasn't there. It was told to me by a third party, um, co-worker that works with the grandma told somebody that I know and they told me this, but, uh, again, I don't have, uh, no proof of that. You feel me? So, um, another thing that I had said was, uh, about an arrest that was made not so long ago, um, here in the, in this area. Uh, dealing with um, you know with supposedly was uh, behind uh, Dulce Maria but um, again there's no actual proof of that I haven't found nothing online and nine times out of ten you know information like that is public information and um, again I haven't ran into nothing uh, on that myself so Again, I'm still waiting on some receipts to come at y'all with that. Um, I also spoke about um, 
Steven Vieira, uh, the dude that uh, got arrested for uh, allegedly waving on the little 14 year old girl, trying to get into his car or whatever. Or he did get into, I, I don't know what, 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 what the details was, but dude was arrested for waving on a little 14 or 15 year old uh, little girl trying to snatch her up or did snatch her up um, uh, we haven't heard nothing else about that that's my question on that uh, why is it that we haven't heard any more on this gentleman Steven Vieira um, if you guys could help me out in the comment section uh, let me know what the deal is with him I would gladly appreciate it I also spoke about um, how so many people claim to know this family, but yet nobody knows nothing. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Uh, I was speaking to someone that claims that th they were good friends back in the day with um, little Dulce's mother. How um, she stated on the Dr. Phil show that uh, she wasn't friends with no black people, but yet this person says that... Uh, she had a lot of black friends. Then there's another rumor floating around that uh, uh, Dulce's mom owed, uh, I guess her name is Naoma. She owed some Jamaicans some money. And, um, you know, they wanted the kid or some something to them lines. And she gave up her daughter for, you know, to pay that debt that she owed. But again, it's all rumors. You feel me? It's all rumors. Another question that I had was, what, why is there uh, a sudden interest in um, Billy Jones? You know, he's been missing for a long time, for uh, a minute now. For I know that he would be 50 years old now. He was like five years old when he was uh, turned up missing. So, um, you know, why is there a, su a, a sudden interest in this case? And why is it that it's so similar i believe that i was one of the first ones that broke that how this case was so similar to billy jones you feel me why is it now that everyone is has this sudden interest um in that case that's just a question that i had is if you my audience could help me out with answering that question hey the comment section is open for that you know what I'm saying another thing that I wanted to say was uh, th this little girl's been missing for over three months now it's going on four months and there's not yet been a, an attempt to put up some cameras in that park you feel me there's a school there you know what I'm saying right there you know what I'm saying? You got a, 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 a city building right there in the park. You feel me? Then you got the Bristol Hall of Fame right there in that area. Then, like, right down the street, you have the jail. So, um, you know, you, you know what I'm saying? Why isn't there cameras all through there? Or is there cameras and we just don't know about it? You feel me? Because the authorities ain't gonna tell you, tell us everything that they know. You feel me? Do they know more than what uh, they letting out, or what? What's what's the deal here? You know what I'm saying? Uh, like I said before, when I was out there searching, I had ran into the city worker quite a few times in the park and in the surrounding areas of Bristol. You know what I'm saying? My tire was flat. When I was out there, there was a mysterious looking dude with a hoodie on. Looked like he was working out. Um, I got pictures of him, but can't really tell who he is. But anyway, I'm out of time right now, my good peoples. I'm going to um, catch y'all on the next one. Once I get some actual information on this, some real proof, I'll go live with it. And um, we'll discuss it on the live setting. I'm sorry that I haven't been able to keep my promises um hopefully once uh i'm in a com more comfortable spot i will be able to be more consistent with my um lives and my videos with that said my good people be sure to um like the video 
subscribe to the channel if you're not already a subscriber. Leave me a comment and subscribe to the Voices of Duces channel below. Peace.